All right, so as you can see here, we're gonna hop in the shower and wash this hair of mine. Now, my hair, this is bit, it was like three weeks since I washed my hair in this video. So as you can see, I get the shampoo, uh, I put some on my hands. I'm gonna leave the link for it in the description. I forget what it's called, but it's really good because uh, it also helps detangle your hair. So as you can see, I let the water like soak all up through my hair, pretty much get it all wet. And then I get the shampoo, put it on my hands, rub it back and forth, and I'm putting a lot of guys. Like, yeah, as you can see, I get the bottle, end up putting, the, putting it on my head. But I'm just rubbing it through, you know, make sure I get every crevice, you know, every little bit of my hair. And as you can see, I turned off the camera, that shit's in my eye, but my hair is clean now, so on to the next part. You know? Okay, so we're done in the shower right now, you know what I'm saying? I just, I didn't condition my hair, I just washed my hair. Um, the reason why I only wash my hair I should have conditioned my hair in a minute because every time I wash my hair, I do a deep conditioner. So that kind of eliminates the uh, the need to condition my hair, at least in my opinion. That's what I've always done. But anyways, you know what I'm saying? Here's a hair. I still need to detangle. So we'll be using this detangling brush. I think I got this from Walmart. And pretty much we're just going to be going through like that. And it's not going to be perfect, obviously, because... You know what I'm saying? It's a brush, but this is going to be good enough so I can actually put the deep conditioner in my hair, you know, and because I'm also going to be detangling it even more when I do the two strand twist. So as you can see, you see these little knots right here? This is build up knots right there. It's build up knots, you know, those got to go. As you can see, my finger, I don't know if you can see that. It's called focused. But anyways, those that, that's like little knots with like build up in it. And I get a lot of those. So when I start getting those, that's when I know it's time to wash. So now we're just gonna be, you know, brushing out all of these little knots, you know what I'm saying? Trying to do the best I can to detangle my hair. So that's the best way to do this guys is to, honestly, you're supposed to section your hair out with my hair. I don't think my hair is long enough for that. So I just go, come down, come gently, don't be too rough. And just detangle, you should feel it. And you'll notice on the brush too, how much hair is on a brush and this is normal this is this is uh like i said this is dead hair um this is hair you know what i'm saying build up hair type shit as you can see right here that's a lot of hair so we're gonna keep doing that for i don't know how long it's gonna take me but hey man let's, let's get it bro So when y'all get a knot like this in your hair, like this, what you want to do is you want to start pulling from the bottom and then just pull one strand at a time. Just like that. I don't know if you can see that. Pull one strand at a time. So you get, boom. This comes out just like that. I, I lost it in this other strand of hair, but y'all get the point. So, hey man, I'm going to catch y'all when I'm done. So the tangling is done, guys. As you can see, as you can see, it's pretty much detangled damn near i'd say 90 percent so now we're going to be putting the deep conditioner in my hair and i'm going to show y'all what deep conditioner that i use for this hair and uh, i've been using this for the past two months i say it's pretty good i've been using the miel's rosemary strengthening hair mask and it's really good uh it feels minty on my head and moisturizes put some moisture back in my hair that i just took out and stripped with the shampoo so i'll be applying this i'll be using my hands and then uh, i'll be combing it through with the uh the, the brush so Y'all gonna watch me do that. Um, when you're doing this, it's good. Like I said, it's good to detangle your hair before you do this. It's also good to take your time. Don't cause any more breakage if you don't need to. And really just make sure you're getting every single strand. And really just get into deep, deep, deep pores of your hair, cherishing it, you know, like you're massaging someone's back, you know what I'm saying? You know, you know, but. So y'all finna see it real quick. And, yeah. Good amount throughout my head and pretty much i'm just trying to get this all the way through it you know as you can see i'm doing this method i say i call this the claw method or the slick bag method uh you'll see it again shortly but as you can see i'm just like the slick bag method trying to get this all throughout my hair you know what i'm saying make sure i'm getting every crevices like i said earlier just getting everything because like this is what's gonna really moisturize your hair okay so i think i've done a pretty good job making sure this is all my hair. One more dial up won't hurt. You know what I'm saying? Better too mo too much moisture than too little moisture. So let's get it all in my hair. You know what I'm saying? Now, 
Well, we, all we gotta do, oh my goodness, we're gonna break that. But all we gotta do now is, I got shit in here, but I uh, just find any regular grocery bag, right? And just tie that bitch on your head like a do rag. So, boom. Boom. And then. Boom. So once it's tied, you press it like this, right? And then you want to get a bonnet, put it over your head like that, just like that. Now mind, mind you, you're supposed to keep this in your hair for around an hour with heat, but me, I don't do all that. I usually just keep this all in my head overnight. So we're going to keep it in my head overnight. And then we're gonna wake up and wash it out. And then it's time for two strand twist, baby. You know what I'm saying? So so I've just taken off the shower cap after leaving it in overnight. And yeah, as you can see, my hair shrunk bad. But we're gonna be washing this out of our hair. And then we're gonna let it dry and we're gonna be doing two strand twists on our head. So stay tuned. Um, I'm not gonna record washing it out because it's just a pretty self explanatory process, but I'll be right back when it's all washed out. So, yeah, okay, so the hair is washed as you can see. Um, just the camera, but the hair is washed, and now we're gonna start the two strands. So, what I like to do when my hair is wet a little bit, not too wet, but also we're gonna be using this is my go to. Um, it's not gonna focus. There you go. Uh, mango, lime, Jamaican mango and lime cream, uh, locking, fuck, Jamaican mango and lime locking cream wax with seed oil and macuna honey. And uh, I like to use this, but pretty much, I don't really part my hair, but I do like a, like a slight middle part. So I just get my comb. I'm not gonna like, have a crooked middle part. Like, Oh, shit. Yeah. Wait, I'm a, man, I can't get this right on camera now. Can't get this right on camera. Okay. Just like that. Perfect. It's, I'm not even tripping. I just need something to where I know where to start on my head. Pretty much, so. And that's the side. And now, depending on how big you want to make your twist, I usually do small twists, but I think I'll make a little bit bigger today. So. You want to get a strand of hair just like this. You want to section it out. I'm saying use your fingers to kind of part it. And then move the hairs you don't want. Like you see, like a hair, like like this right here. Kind of just move. You see that right there? Just like that. So you see, you got like a good little little section right here. Nothing perfect. And so you're gonna take your cream and you open it with one hand type shit while I hold this section. I probably should have did this before. And now, you're just gonna get this, put it on your finger like that, and then get it on the root, and then go down just like this. As you can see, bring it down, and now you could like spread it in. And like, if you don't have enough, put some on the eye, put some on the tips, you know what I'm saying, to lock it in. And pretty much, all you're gonna do, you're gonna get this strand right here, you're gonna split it into two, like that, and then over, 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 and then go all the way till you get to the tip. Over, 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 and if there's like cream, it will dry up, but over, 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 and then coil it around your finger. Just like that, boom. Now you gotta twist. Now I know some people like to use a clip to hold it down. I'll probably do that this time, but as you can see, you got one twist. So I'm trying to do the rest of the head. Um, I'll do one more for y'all. So like I said right here, just take it. Boom, separate it, separate. I don't want to make this too big now. Separate it, I think, I think that's good. That's good, that's good. So you get the cream. Cream, put it on top just like that. 
just like that. And then it's going to go the same motion. Boom, boom. I can do it really fast. Boom, 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 boom. guys it doesn't look as good as i thought um honestly guys i just tie dry i shrunk up and stuff but we're gonna make some we're gonna make it look good so pretty much i got the foam setting mousse and you're just gonna put this all over your head all over this is gonna help it a lot i'm just gonna pretty much drown my head in this you know what i'm saying and then just boom Boom. Let me see, they shaking, they shaking. See, now it's starting to look a little better. It's starting to look way better type shit. As you can see, as you can see, it's starting to look way better. I'm just getting that all through my hair and then I'm just brushing it down or laying it down on my hands. And I think this is the finished look, guys. Um, not as good as I could have done, you know. So I need to do a cut and a taper, which will be in the next part of this video. But these are twists. As you can see, I'm going to give you all a little 360 right now. I'll be using this new Island oil or Island oil um, from Jamaican mango and lime. I think it just came out. It's all at Walmart. And I'll just be oiling my scalp with this. So let me open it and then I'm just gonna apply this to my scalp. There we go. There we go. Just make sure you're getting all the crevices and stuff like that. And you're good. So, I actually never recorded an outro for this video. I know, crazy. But, I hope y'all enjoyed this. You know, I hope y'all enjoyed the twist. You got the same twist. These are, uh, you, those, that video was made a week ago. So, I got a new set of twists in. Uh, I'm gonna try to do a new tutorial with me partnering my hair. So, y'all stay tuned for that. And I'm gonna be making more content like this on this channel. And I hope you guys enjoy. If y'all have any questions, leave them down below, please. I'm always glad and happy to answer. But it's your boy Be Smooth and we out.